Hello, everyone, and welcome. My name is Sudhir Mata. I'm the VP of products here at Juniper's AI-driven enterprise. If you're a current Juniper customer or partner, thank you very much for joining us. We really appreciate your partnership. And if you're brand new to the Juniper family, thank you very much for joining our global summit. You're going to learn here the technology that is the underpinnings of the network of the next decade. Some of the largest enterprises in the world are building their network of the next decade with Juniper. And we appreciate you coming to learn a little bit more about what we have to offer. It's an amazing time to be in networking. The fundamental fabric of networking is changing the way we know it and use it. AI is everywhere. Cloud is front and center. And we are transforming networks like never before. And Juniper is at the forefront of this AI-driven enterprise. So let me dive into it. First, why do we feel such passion? Why do we feel such conviction that this is the network of the next decade? Let me start with some industry proof points. Let's look at the analyst perspective. Gartner recently released their 2020 magic quadrant for the wired and wireless LAN access infrastructure. And Juniper was positioned as what I believe is the leader of the leaders, with Gartner positioning us as a leader highest for the ability to execute of all the vendors in this magic quadrant. Let's explore the journey. In the 2018 iteration of the same magic quadrant, Juniper was a niche player and Miss Systems was a visionary. As we came together in 2019, our synergies in product and people grew. And that year, Gartner positioned us as the vendor furthest to the right in the visionary quadrant. And in 2020, we moved to be, in my opinion, a clear leader of the leaders in the Gartner magic quadrant for wired and wireless LAN. I have not seen any other vendor in the networking industry move up four positions in the quadrant. There has to be something here. So thank you for joining us to learn about the unique innovation that is transforming the industry. Next, let's look at some customer proof points. If you go to the Gartner Peer Insights for wired and wireless LAN access infrastructure market, we are the number one rated product for Wi-Fi switching in the enterprise. This is game changing. Many of the customer reviews there are just absolutely stunning and amazing. And today, I'm going to lay out for you the what, the how, and the why of this technology. So let's dive into it. Let's start with the technology itself. There are five fundamental pillars that constitute the amazing technology of the Juniper AI-driven enterprise. They enable a fundamental paradigm shift in terms of how you build your network of the next decade. Let's start with user experience. Historically, we built networks with switches and controllers, APs, and routers. And we measured if the network uptime is good. But we've moved far from that. When MIST came onto the scene in networking, we were the first ones to say, we have to measure the network experience based on user experience. To this day, 
we believe we are the only networking vendor measuring the user experience on every user, every minute basis. And you're going to see in the demo after this presentation. And if you need a deeper dive, there are detailed sessions at the AI Driven Enterprise Bootcamp. Once you have this kind of data, you could do magic with it. There are only two types of users on your network. There are wireless users and wired users. And Juniper is the only one that's bringing AI across the wired and wireless spectrum with a single AI ops platform. And then we took that even further with the recent acquisition of the amazing 128 technology team, combining that with Juniper strength in routing. We also believe we are the first and only vendor bringing client to cloud technology together so we can apply AI from the user to the wireless network, to the wired network, to the WAN edge, up into the public and private data centers. This enables us to deliver AI across the entire spectrum. This is uniquely Juniper Mist. And so when you explore a proof of concept with us, when you see some of the demos that are coming up in the next sections, you're going to appreciate what it means to extend AI from client to cloud. The third pillar of technology for us is the self-driving network. Absolutely unequivocally, we are the only self-driving network in the industry. When you can build self-driving cars, really, it's actually not beyond the reach to build a self-driving network. If you have the right data, you have the right AI primitives, you have the right algorithms, you can actually build an amazing self-driving network. What does that mean? It means a network that can self-diagnose and remediate problems it can fix without IT intervention. So the easy ones are, I've got to plan my RF properly. I need to plan my channels and my power properly. Even though other vendors can try, we are the only ones using AI for this. We do AI-driven RRM. Good, got it. But really, you can take this one step further. Some of the most commonly occurring problems in the networking industry are problems caused by software. Problems caused by, you know, maybe a defective chip in the hardware. But if the network can be self-aware, we can actually be self-driving. Later in my demo, you're going to see some examples of the self-driving network where we actually make the network better while IT is sleeping. The fourth pillar of our technology foundation is a modern microservices cloud architecture that delivers functionality to the cloud. And we are the only networking vendor who has the agility and the elasticity today Every single week, literally, we say Christmas comes every Wednesday with the Juniper Mist Cloud. You need a network that is agile. It is actually agility that brings stability. Because if you see something out there, we fix it fast. You don't have to schedule downtime and upgrades. Agility brings stability. Agility brings reaction time. If you get a new set of devices and you need to do something fast. So being cloud native and being agile is fundamental 
to the network of the next decade has to be cloud native, has to be agile. Last but not least, your network has to be a digital platform. A platform for innovation, a platform for delivering rich mobile experiences for users by fusing together the location context and the network context. And really, you know it must be the foundation for your digital enterprise. These are the technology underpinnings of the Juniper Mist network right now. But all of this is for nothing if we don't deliver amazing, absolutely amazing IT and user outcomes. So let's start with IT outcomes. There are three things. These are absolutely three things you should expect every time you deploy a Juniper Mist network. Number one, you have to expect it will be the fastest deployment you have ever done. One of the largest service providers in North America said, hey, we have to refresh the network in all of our 2,400 retail stores. They set aside an 18-month timeline. They were finished in five months, in under five months, because of the automation and the simplicity of installation. One of our customers even deploys 2,000, 2,000 access points every single night. Dartmouth College actually put it on Twitter. They said they deployed 1,400 access points in 24 hours. All 2,000 dorm rooms were deployed in under 48 hours. We bring agility of deployment like no other vendor can. Number two, every single Juniper Mist network will see fewer tickets coming into help desk because of the self-driving capabilities, period. This is our commitment to you that the network will learn and materially become better. You will see and hear fewer user complaints independent of the vertical you're in. You can see Coppel ISD said they had a 50% reduction. Yes, 50% reduction in tickets. ServiceNow has said they had a 90% reduction in user open network related tickets. Dartmouth College said they had a 70% reduction in tickets. And you heard it today, earlier today from the VP of IT at MIT, Mark Silas, saying the network just came to life with the deployment of MIST. This is the power of a self-driving network, which has reduced tickets anywhere from 50 to 90% in many of our current customer deployments. This is absolutely game-changing. And the third IT outcome I want you to come to expect when you deploy a Juniper Mist network is when a ticket does come in, let's say it's at 10% we couldn't solve, that comes into your help desk. Your mean time to repair for that ticket is going to be accelerated. One of our customers, a large logistics firm, they're doing a 130 country deployment with us. Their mean time to resolve a ticket went down by 90%. Because in their words, they said, MIST has dynamic packet capture that helps us not 
to wait to reproduce the problem or gather data. All the data, all the data we need when we get a ticket is right in front of us. So the three IT outcomes that I want every one of you to expect when you deploy Juniper Mist are rapid deployments, reduction in tickets, and faster resolution for tickets that do come in. This is the power of AI. This is Juniper driven by Mist AI. Next, let's look at what user outcomes we can drive with this. The user outcome we can drive here is that we can digitize the user experience. Whether you're a visitor walking into a hospital needing turn-by-turn -turn navigation, a patient needing a wheelchair to get to the hospital cafeteria, you're a shopper walking into a retail store, you know, for curbside pickup or assistance in the store. Whether you're an employee coming into the office that uses open workspace for hybrid office, remote work, now you can locate conference rooms, other employees without printed maps. Whatever it is, we digitize the enterprise because we have a patented 16 antenna element BLE array built into every single access point. No other vendor, not Cisco, not Aruba, not Meraki can do this. This is uniquely Juniper Mist. This is built into every access point so we can digitize enterprises like never before. And then, for helping customers adapt to the COVID-19 environment, we launched contact tracing. These are proximity tracing applications that are absolutely stunning. In fact, at Juniper, for our own enterprise, with employees in business critical functions starting to return to work, every single employee is getting a Bluetooth BLE badge that enables our employee health and safety and security teams to reduce risk. Our team can now be alerted proactively if employees exceed the reduced capacity of meeting rooms to remind them of social distancing. Before our solution, businesses had to hire additional security staff to manually police this. And if there was an unfortunate instance of COVID-19 positive for one of the employees in the office, literally instantly, there is an electronic proximity tracing map of who have been in contact with this employee, with patient zero, whom will have to quarantine until they can be assured they were not infected. It also enables us to identify which areas in the building need to be cleaned and sanitized to keep everyone safe while we minimize cost. The digital enterprise of the next generation starts with Juniper Mist Networks. Now, you don't think I would go on stage without doing a demo. Let me show you the power of the AI-driven enterprise in this quick nine-minute tour. Our 2021 innovations are around the client to cloud theme with Marvis as the foundation. And it all starts for us with the user. Historically, the MIST dashboard has had incredible visibility around the user's experience. Now with the launch of Marvis Client SDK, with the Marvis client, we're able to now get data directly from the client. So when a user, when a client device roams from an AP to another AP, not only do we have the infrastructure view of this, but we actually have the exact client view of that particular roam. 
And this gives us, this footprint on the device gives us an ability to see what radio is running on the device, what driver version is running on the device, what device type it is. All of this helps us in providing better and better and better user experience as a network. Next up is wireless. Wireless is today the crown jewel of our portfolio and the absolute best in the industry. We are doubling down on wireless innovation here. So nothing is bigger than our self-driving notion of AI-driven RRM that continually makes your network better while you're sleeping. With the new AI-driven RRM, we are able to automatically move radios into the five gig band, providing you with ultra high density Wi-Fi with completely hands off, completely no manual user intervention RRM. This is game changing. Next up is Marvis Actions. Marvis Actions is our proactive dashboard that enables users to be able to take actions before users complain. And so there's a ton of new Marvis actions coming out. Obviously the coverage hole detection Marvis action is out and is, is showing tremendous results in some of the largest networks in the world. There's misconfigured clients, persistently bad failing clients, DHCP anomalies on the wired side, you know, dual band clients connecting on 2.4 gig. There's so many interesting Marvis actions around the corner. This absolutely makes network IT proactive every step of the way. On the location front, with the new proximity zones for occupancy analytics, we are able to now create zones, whether you are a 10 AP site or a 10 site organization, a 100 site organization, or a 5,000 site organization, with a click of a button, you're able to create zones on your dashboard without you know, manually drawing them. After wireless, you come to our wired assurance. On the wired assurance side, we are super excited. We are going to be the first truly cloud native, complete campus deployments. The MIST dashboard will be able to configure complete EVP and VXLAN micro segmentation networks from the MIST dashboard. This is awesome. That means the largest of the large networks from a campus perspective. Today, many distributed environments already use wired assurance for configuration. So wired assurance for large college campuses, for large corporate deployments, uh, you know, co-located large uh, networks is coming to the MIST dashboard this quarter. And if you're interested, please let your Juniper Miss sales team know to get you a beta access to this. This is absolutely awesome. After the wired network, we go to the WAN. On the WAN side, we're launching WAN Assurance uh, with complete WAN visibility into the application and the user. Using AI with the user as the focus and the pivot point on the WAN side, understanding the user and the application experience will be game changing. This is now available for SRX customers. If you need access, let us know, reach out to us, and we'll shortly be widely available for all customers. Then next up is our advanced SD-WAN, our session smart SD-WAN from the 128 technology team. Missed integration of the SD-WAN session smart routing here is awesome because this proves to you the agility, the programmability, the flexibility of the 128 technology, which is already deployed in many large, large, large deployments, tens of thousands of sites deployments. 
this SD-WAN technology is now going to be able to stream data to the MIST cloud for WAN assurance. Just like WAN assurance with SRX customers, WAN assurance with session smart routing customers is, is also coming to your MIST dashboard. We are super stoked about this. This represents the best AI engine in the industry, Marvis, speaking to the absolute best SD-WAN technology on the planet today from 128 Technology. Next up, nothing is bigger in the land of Marvis than the conversational interface. So let's dive into what does this mean? The conversational interface lets you have a conversation with the Marvis AI engine. Ask questions. What's going on with my network? You know, what's happening with a user's device? What's, you know, who's having a bad Wi-Fi day? Show me unhappy users. Take it to the switches. Troubleshoot switches. Being able to understand what's going on with your network. What's going on with your switches? Understand, so without deep study of logs, like every other competitor in the market, Marvis AI is now able to understand you and able to provide answers in seconds, in sub-second, uh, being able to know what's going on with your network, whether that is troubleshooting APs, troubleshooting users, troubleshooting um, switches, or troubleshooting the entire site. The Marvis conversational interface is available today. Today is the day we're launching it to all beta customers. If you want access to Marvis Conversation Interface, please reach out to your Juniper Miss sales team and ask them to enable this for you as beta access. It is available now and we are super stoked. This is gonna change the way networks are operated. Um, networks are, you know, help desk operates this, operations teams operates networks. This we believe is how we should build the future of networking. So lots of very, very interesting uh, possibilities with the Marvis conversational interface. And then there is one more thing. This we are super stoked about, and this is the integration of the Marvis conversational interface with systems like Slack. So being able to actually integrate Marvis conversational interface natively into Slack and execute the same type of queries that you just saw me show on the conversational interface. Now you can integrate natively into Slack or we have the APIs for integrating into any kind of chatbot type of interface. This is awesome. This again, you know, going to where the users, where the help desk users, where the network operations users have become comfortable these days, going into systems where it's native and being able to enable this kind of interaction with Marvis conversational interface natively into Slack is absolutely game changing. So the hits and the innovation continue. The AI driven enterprise will continue to outpace our competitors with one singular, one singular um, uh, vision in mind. This is to deliver the absolute best experience in the industry. This is what experience first networking is for the IT operator and the end user. Now that you understand the technologies and the amazing IT outcomes we're driving that are game changing, as well as the experiences we're driving for users that are rich and digital, let's now look at how you can get started with us. If you're thinking, wow, this is really good, but wait, I have a Cisco network. I have an Aruba network. I have a Meraki network. What do I do? Where do I start? Think of one of these four scenarios as your starting point. If you have APs or switches or routers that are at the end of the life and you need to organically refresh them, that's a great place to start with Juniper Mist. Just give us a shot at a proof of concept in your lab network, and if that works well, well, then extend it to your pilot site. 
you will not regret the proof of concept with Juniper Mist. Let's say you don't have switches and routers or APs that are old, but maybe you're opening a new office, a new store, or a new facility. Give us your expansion opportunity. We have many customers who say, okay, yeah, I have 10,000 Aruba APs, but for everything net new, we're going to buy Juniper Mist. All you're doing is adding a new facility, one new building in your enterprise. Please give a shot for the Juniper Mist network in that building. Let's say that doesn't exist. You don't have an organic refresh. You don't have an expansion site. In that case, pick your worst building. The building that you wish you really didn't own because the number of complaints you get from that building. Give us that building. Give us your absolute worst place in the network and we will make it better. That's how confident we feel. That's how invincible we feel. Give us a shot. If none of these exist, then please give us a shot for digitizing your experiences with Bluetooth Low Energy and for a solution like customer engagement, employee engagement, or contact tracing. So please, we have only one ask of you. If you are new to the Juniper network, what we want you to know is this is the network of the next decade. And the best way you can start with us is a proof of concept. Reach out to us. We will help you get started on your journey with Juniper. While I focused primarily on the wired and wireless portion of the portfolio today, I am excited to introduce Sue Graham Johnston, the president of 128 Technology, who will share the latest innovations on our client to cloud vision as it comes into focus with the AI driven SD van. Thank you, Sadir. I'm thrilled to join you and to extend a warm welcome to our amazing customers and partners. Spending time with customers is the part of my job that I most enjoy. So I'll take a minute on my background with the hope that I get to work with at least some of you in the near future. I spent a little over three years as the president of 128 Technology before the acquisition. And prior to that, I was managing director of a nearly $2 billion industrial products company, driving my own digital transformation agenda. I'm now a general manager at Juniper and working hard to bring our session smart SD-WAN solution to customers across the globe. Let's talk a little bit about our session smart technology and why we were such a perfect fit for Juniper. If you take away just a few thoughts, here they are. We're the future. Session Smart is the next generation of SD-WAN, SD-WAN 3.0, if you will. We've innovated in routing in ways the legacy vendors simply can't touch, which is why Juniper is the perfect home for us. It's engineered for experiences. With the industry's only session-based routing fabrics, we've cracked the code for delivering quality experiences for end users and IT alike. Customers have seen up to 60% reduction in quality killing latency, for example. We offer the best TCO in the industry by eliminating clunky tunnels, maximizing performance, and delivering it all in software that runs in the branch, in the data center, and in the cloud. Our customers have seen 30 to 50% reduction in bandwidth cost. And our SD-WAN fabrics scale to 10,000 or more edges, breaking through the limitations of tunnel-based legacy solutions, all the while deploying routers and services at warp speed. And finally, Session Smart bakes zero trust security and segmentation 
into the routing fabric itself with our deny all secure vector routing. You can't have zero trust secure access without a zero trust fabric, period. Most importantly, I'm delighted to report that the market is responding favorably as evidenced by accelerating customer momentum across multiple segments. For large enterprises, especially in retail and healthcare, we've experienced tremendous success delivering performance improvements at massive scale. At a national retail healthcare provider, we won based on our differentiated technology and cost savings. We are now delivering a 10,000 site SD-WAN deployment with improved reliability and decreased congestion, all the while saving them tens of millions of dollars. A key executive called our technology an absolute game changer. We're also delivering across the globe. Another great example from Europe is a multinational pet supply retailer with over 1,600 sites across Europe. With our MSP partner, we are delivering a managed SD-WAN service across their entire footprint. We've received very positive feedback from this customer, especially around the consistent high quality user experience, no matter which country the store is located in. We're making major strides in the federal sector with our strategic partner, Microsoft. We have an arm of the military that demanded true innovation in their network modernization, which resulted in replacing the incumbent vendor virtually everywhere with the Session Smart router. Together, we are enabling multiple ARM services to accelerate their move to the cloud and to improve the security posture for cloud-based applications, all the while optimizing their user experience for Office 365. Carriers and managed service provider partners have become a significant growth engine for the Session Smart portfolio. For example, our partner CMC, the largest Pan-African and Middle Eastern carrier, has standardized on the Session Smart solution and will be the first African player to have an intelligent network powered by 128 Technology and Juniper. Granite Telecommunications and our other partners like Momentum, SoftBank and Converge One are seeing highly differentiated improvements in scale, performance, margins, and time to revenue, further giving them a competitive advantage. To learn more about how we are helping CMC networks, be sure to join their customer conversation session. Thank you for the time. We are so thrilled to be a part of Juniper and I know we're poised for success in 2021. The combination of the Session Smart Router with Juniper's AI-driven enterprise portfolio proves that the future is already happening. We are truly better together. Wouldn't you agree, Sudhir? Yes, Sue. I couldn't agree more. Together, the AI-driven enterprise is helping customers, large and small, by delivering the experience-first network from client to cloud. We are the leader with the highest ability to execute in the 2020 Gartner Magic Quadrant for wired and wireless. And customers have already seen real results with, from Mist AI and Session Smart Routing, including a 30 to 50% reduction in bandwidth costs over the van, reduction in help desk tickets by 50 to 90%, a reduction in mean time to resolve by 90%. To hear more, check out the customer conversations in the sessions coming up. Connect with our teams and our partners to get started in transforming your user and IT experiences through a proof of concept. Or better yet, jump right in. Start deploying Juniper Mist. Let us partner with you in building your network of the next decade.